We're getting a little work done on the junk buggy. I pulled its front springs out, so when we're ready to put this back in there, it will be lower. And I gotta change the front springs up anyways. So, spent some time in my buddy's garage. Thanks, Jim. Uh, we turned this adapter, or I guess alignment jig actually, turned that down. Um, this was the old clutch plate for the NP435. Cut off the pilot bearing nipple, whatever you want to call it, extrusion. Um, turned down the Honda Goldwing one side of the U joint. Um, so now I'm going to. This goes in there. Nice snug fit. Then this guy goes like so. So I'll, hammer, I'll tap them together, put a weld bead around it. Use the use the drill with the bench grinder to put a chamfer on there. So I'll weld those together, run a weld around it, smooth it out, and then this is just going to be another supportive piece that will slip onto the whole assembly. And then um, I'll weld it around again, sort of a belt and suspenders approach. And then I'll be able to marry the Honda Goldwing motor to the NP435, which is married to the uh, LT, what, 230, I believe it is, Land Rover transmission. This is the another adapter that I'm sure the haters are gonna hate on, but it should hold. It's only Honda Goldwing motor, so it's not a ton of power coming through this, but grade eight bolts, use another alignment jig. So I, I highly doubt this is gonna break eight grade eight bolts, so. Looking forward to getting it all married up and then I gotta, I gotta do some more work here, but it's getting there.